Now this reading is going to be for Virgo for the middle of October. How you doing, Virgo? If y'all are doing well, please hit the like, share, and subscribe. Let me shuffle these up from the last reading a little bit before I start shuffling your energy into them. What do you have for Virgo? For the middle of October, Virgo. For the middle of October. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My hair is falling out. Excuse my work shirt. There's some other things that I've got to do today. But I wanted to get a few readings out for the mid-month. Mid Temperance at the bottom of the deck. You have the Ten of Staffs working, Virgo. The Two of Coins. The Eight of Coins. The Five of Swords. And the Eight of Staffs. Alright, Spirit, could you clarify the Ten of Staffs? What heavy load is Virgo carrying? kind of work we got going on here for the Virgos. Thank you. Change. You're working towards change. Clarify the two of coins. Why are they juggling? Virgo, mid October. Thank you. Mature woman. Clarify eight of coins. Thank you. Message of concern. Clarify five of swords. Thoughts. Eight of staffs. Clarify eight of staffs. Mature man and clarify temperance, please. Thank you. Official person. <clears throat> Let me get clarifies for the clarifiers. It makes it a good story when I do it this way. Although I, everybody says, oh, you don't have to put clarifiers on every card. No, I don't. But, you know, I can get a little bit better story when I do. Alright, give me one on the change on the ten of staffs. Whoa, I said one, not all the deck. Thank you. Seven of coins. Alright, give me one on the mature woman on the two of coins. <clears throat> <laughs> Give me one on the message of concern. These cards are so heavy. I feel like you have a heavy burden, Virgo. A heavy burden. King of Swords. On thoughts. King of Coins, King of Cups, a oh, mature man. Here's the mature man. What are they fighting for? Where's Virgo fighting for them? Thanks. Ace of Cups. I'm fighting for you, love. I'm fighting for your heart. I'm singing terrible, ain't I? Mm -hmm. 
Give me one on this two of staffs and two of coins and mature woman. What are we juggling here? What's going on? What path are we choosing? What's happening there? Thank you. Lost person. Hmm. Give me one on this king of swords. And let me get one this Knight of Cups. Just has to be. Toils and labor. <clears throat> All right, Virgo. Something has got to change. The load on you, the burdens on you have got to change. You are carrying a 10 pound sack of burdens and you need to take it down to about 7 pounds. <laughs> okay, that's what I'm saying. Um, people just keep adding more on you and more on you and more on you and you're just about at a breaking point. Okay, you were expecting someone to come in and help you and they did not or you feel like they did not. Okay, I'm seeing this person still wants to be your official person. They are still fighting for your love. Okay, it could be a Sagittarius. It could be an Aquarius. It could be... Oh, excuse me. Oh. Any sign, really. There is a woman who keeps stepping in your way. Every time you go to choose a path, there is a woman who steps in your way. And it looks like you're choosing the path towards goodness and prosperity and she'll step in your way. And then you have, she's keeping you in a type of poverty is what it looks like. Um, this is what the message of concern is. Alright. It looks like that this person does not want you to be with an Aquarius, if it's if it is, or to have a relationship with some kind of Aquarius. All right, give me one more on this false person of how that's going to turn out for the false person. Despair. Yeah, this person is trying to cause despair for sure. I see it in there. Um, give me, give me two at the top. Mid October. What does Virgo need to keep their mind on? Poverty and child. Okay, you may need to keep it light, you may need to keep it young, you may need to uh, hold on to your money, is what I'm seeing. Because I'm also seeing this person uh, steal, steal or sending someone in to steal, okay? They may also, I, I get stealing your thoughts. So Virgo, I get stealing your thoughts. They're, they're watching everything you do so they can make you miserable, is what I'm seeing. Stealing your thoughts. 
So they may be having cameras on you. They may be listening to your conversations. Uh, they may, may be reading your Facebook or whatever you have, your blog. Stealing your thoughts so they can offer you a cup. But I don't see them wanting to work in your life as a positive person, whoever that is, whoever this mature woman is. I don't see her wanting to work in your life as a positive person. I see her wanting to hold you down for all the negative she can. This is a she. So it could be a friend of yours uh, that's not actually a friend. She's a false person. Um, a co-worker. Very well could be a co-worker because you have the eight of coins up there with the message of concern right up underneath of it. Okay? You could have a some kind of partnership with an Aquarius, and whoever this mature lady is, is trying to wreak havoc on that, okay? But I definitely see she's trying to wreak havoc. And when she gets finished wrecking havoc with that, she's going to see this other person coming in to try to get your love or whatever, your partner or whatever, she's going to try to wreak havoc on that. I can see that. I see it in the cards. I'm looking at them from every angle. Um, Miss Cleo, do you have... I got chills. Oh, I got chills. Four coins, hold on tight to your money, Virgo. The building is going to be slow. But you do have some people working in your favor for you to have the will of fortune. And since I set them right there, you know, um, I got chills. I got chills so bad. I see this person trying to head out the out the door with your money. They're trying to keep some funds away from you. This could even be a relative of yours. Because I almost see like an inheritance or... An inheritance, or maybe someone... No, I don't see anybody passing in the family. Alright, Virgo, that is your reading for the mid-October. -oc Save your money. Because whoever this mature woman is is trying to make sure you don't have any money and she's doing it any way she can. If you'd like a personal reading, everything is over in my about. We can get more into this to see what's going on, who's going on, and all that good stuff. I'm saying this person is very jealous. She's very jealous of what you get, of what you do, of who you do it with. And I'm saying that your life is not even about this person in it.
she just kind of sees you from the side and it's like I don't like your life being so positive I don't like your life being so good I'm going to come in here and muck some stuff up maybe it's just misery loves company Alright, Virgo, that's your reading. Like, share, and subscribe. Thanks. Did I turn it upside down? No. Okay.